at the Africa Aerospace and Defense AAD 2024 exhibition, Centaur Defense Systems LLC, a Chinese manufacturer, unveiled its innovative DFX-50 loitering munition, inspired by the Iranian Shahid-136 drone. This event highlighted the increasing trend of loitering munitions in modern warfare, with the DFX-50 being one of several systems reflecting this evolution, including the larger DFX-100, also known as the GHQ-100. The DFX-50 is designed for flexibility and cost-effectiveness, boasting a lightweight structure crafted from composite materials and expanded polyolefin EPO. This choice of materials not only reduces manufacturing costs but also accelerates production timelines, allowing for rapid deployment across diverse operational contexts. With a wingspan of 1.8 meters, a length of 1.6 meters, and a height of 0.3 meters, the DFX-50 has a maximum takeoff weight of 16.5 kilograms and can carry a payload of up to 5 kilograms. It employs an air ejection launch method and cruises at a speed of 26 meters per second, with an impressive endurance exceeding 120 minutes and a range of over 100 kilometers. The drone operates at a cruise altitude below 3,000 meters, capable of achieving a strike speed of 250 meters per second. These features make it particularly suitable for missions requiring long endurance and precise engagement of various targets. The DFX-50 is equipped with an electro-optical seeker that enables it to automatically identify, track and engage both stationary and moving targets. Its control system is adaptable for different application scenarios, focusing on precision targeting by allowing operators to set specific coordinates. Centaur Defense Systems also showcased the larger DFX-100 or GHQ-100, which is positioned as a cost-effective remote precision-guided missile. This system is designed to strike known targets by hovering over mission areas for extended periods, allowing for flexible attack options. The DFX-100 features a wingspan of 2.9 meters and a fuselage length of 3.3 meters, with a takeoff weight of 110 kilograms and a maximum flight ceiling of 3,000 meters. Its operational range extends up to 1,000 kilometers, with a cruising speed of 150 kilometers per hour and an impressive endurance of up to 8 hours. The system can carry a warhead weighing 50 kilograms, capable of causing damage over a range of 150 to 300 meters. Like its smaller counterpart, the DFX-100 is designed for rapid deployment, being operational within 30 minutes. It can be launched from a single UAV launcher, providing versatility in its operational use. The targeting systems incorporated allow for beyond visual range operations, ensuring precise strikes on predetermined targets with advanced navigation and terminal guidance functions. The DFX-50 and DFX-100 exemplify the global trend of countries developing loitering munitions inspired by the Iranian Shahid-136, also known as the Garand-2 in Russian service. The Garand-2, with a range of up to 2,500 kilometers and a 90 kilograms warhead, has gained attention for its cost-effective mass production, making it an accessible option for various military operations. In addition to Centaur's offerings, the influence of the Shahid-136 is evident in other countries' drone developments. Belarus has commenced local manufacturing of the drone under the name Nomad, with its first public showcase occurring during the Independence Parade in Minsk. Similarly, Turkish manufacturer Rabat Technology has produced replicas like the Azab T-150 and T-200, while Israeli company Smart Drones has developed a training version named Delta Wing RS-2 for use by the Israeli Air Force. In Ukraine, a training drone known as Hupolo has been utilized to prepare air defense units for realistic engagements. This emphasis on training with replica drones enables military personnel to develop their skills in detecting and engaging UAV threats, reflecting the importance of realistic scenarios in modern military training. The introduction of the DFX-50 and DFX-100 by Centaur Defense Systems at AAD 2024 signifies a growing commitment to developing loitering munitions that enhance military operational capabilities. As countries worldwide continue to draw inspiration from successful drone designs like the Shahid-136, the proliferation of these technologies will likely shape the future of warfare, emphasizing the need for robust training and tactical adaptability in air defense strategies. With innovative designs and cost-effective production, Centaur's offerings could redefine the landscape of unmanned aerial warfare, offering solutions that cater to a diverse range of operational needs.